Oh man, this is gonna this one's gonna be a bit different to the other ones. Yeah, let's go talk to the assistant. Was he the assistant? Well the guy who's like the sculptor guy, I think. I think it is anyway. Or maybe it is the maybe he just like randomly teleports here that the uh assistant guy. Like we saw him clearly there, but then maybe he just like he arrives here. Oh, busy, busy, busy. What? Oh, I thought he disappeared there. It's just like, whoa, magical teleporting skills. How come this draw point hasn't, like, respawned, but the other one did? There's something back there. Nope. Need any help? Assistance. How can I walk through past them? Okay, there we go. Great news! The other's assistant is going to help me with the statue. Attended as a candidate to become the next elder, so it's very encouraging to receive his help. We should finish in no time. Did you just push me? Great news! I just pushed you. <laughs> it looked like it anyway. Still saying the same stuff. Yep, it is peaceful here. It's the music adds to it, really, doesn't it? The beauty of nature, and uh, they probably like it's probably like you know they made this place themselves, the trees and everything. How do they maintain this down here? Seriously, they even go. They, I mean, well, actually, the pond would be like. Yeah, but the trees, that's that's another thing. I, I don't really know. Maybe, can trees possibly grow underground? I might look it up, but I can't be asked. I think now do we talk to the assistant? Or just the elder, or what? Oh, attendant, don't want to make a statue. Please make yourselves at home. We are kindred spirits. Do we have to leave the place first? Uh, maybe, maybe we'll... Okay, I'll be right back. I'll take the elevator and I'll come back down. Right Righto. Recording has reached an hour mark now. Just a few seconds ago, like six seconds ago. I, I want to talk to you. You got anything else to see now? Especially heard about what happened to Norg. What about Norg? Tell us. Tell us. Why was he an asshole? Especially she's not surprised. Many Shumis have left in search of something. Perhaps hope because life here is so dis... dis dude. Sad thing is there's nothing out there either. They haven't found anything. Indeed they've lost touch with themselves, with who they are. Yeah, we live in different worlds. You are free to determine your fate. We live in the confines of this remote village. That's our fate. But after you make a breakthrough in life, what you see is pretty much the same out there or in here, especially Sphinx. You just gonna repeat the same thing? Specialist also thinks that Nog is a bit of a douche. So, you know what happened to Nog really? Because he like, did he die or did he just like, kind of go into a hibernation kind of state? I, I'm not sure really. You know, there's one freaking thing here. It's just like, it's not accessible. Is it like, not accessible the whole time? It doesn't seem like it's gonna be accessed. To the workshop! Now, if he isn't at the workshop, I'm calling bullcrap. Yep, I see him back there. The forge things would get a little easier, but they haven't at all. The 
that's because that's because the assistant's just standing there, just staring out the window. Assistant, attendant, you can't believe we have to make this silly statue. I wonder what Laguna would make of all this. They made a statue for him. He'd probably be like, he'd probably be a bit emb embarrassed a little, probably. Appreciative, though, most likely, knowing Laguna. But I think we talked to the Elder now. How were they doing? From the look on your face, he must not be working seriously. Well, he did say this is rather silly, so uh, he's not taking it very seriously. The Moomba can help us. Please go ask the Moomba outside for help. It will become an order if I ask, so please. Okie dokie. Mr. Moomba! So he understands what we say, but can't really communicate with, like, uh, you know, speak or anything like that. But he understands, at least. So how does the mumba go about this, then, exactly, anyway? Oh, it's you. What do you want? The attendant isn't gonna do that. The attendant doesn't feel like it. The elder said that. That's not fair. The elder's not giving me any choice. Fine, attendant will work. Success! Did that just, did he just automatically leave the screen there? Yeah, now he's finally working. Okay, okay, attendant will work. Things have gotten a little easier now. But that's not the end of this quest. No, there is still more to be done. You still all busy, busy, busy? Oh, this is busy, 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 busy. Why don't you go help him out? I mean, you're just kind of walking back and forth, saying busy, busy, busy. You haven't even introduced yourself, crying out loud. Seriously, he's the only one in this entire village that hasn't like introduced himself. Other than the three at the top, of course, they were just like, we're just here to guard the ultimate draw point. You had to pay 5,000 gil. Wait, I just realized something. That mumbo, like, communicating with if him, like, with all specific orders, just like, the elder told you this and that. How could he understand with just, like, facial expressions and all that? There's got to be something more to it, otherwise, I don't know. My attendant is finally working. Great, the statue should be completed soon. Maybe it's none of my business, but what's the point of forcing him to do something against his will? You don't understand. There's nobody in this village who admires Master Laguna more than my attendant. There is a reason why my attendant refused to work on this statue in Italy. My attendant strongly wishes to leave here and fight alongside Master Laguna, not to spend time building a statue. Therefore, my attendant does not want to become an elder. One cannot fight or leave the village once one becomes an elder. As Shumi becomes an elder, or something else, I think one must have wits to become an elder. I was very fortunate. 
You know, where are the other elders then? Are you the only one here that's an elder? I believe my attendant will become an elder someday. And he does not want to accept that, obviously. That would really be ironic. Is there any way to prevent the evolution? It's not the shoomy way to abuse our knowledge and pursue personal ambitions. All of us have accepted our destinies. How sad. Well, it sounds like they may need one more person to help. I would love to see my attendant go and pursue personal dreams. I once had dreams too, but as an elder, my responsibilities must always come first. I would love to see my little blah, 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 blah. So, about Norg, he like, he like had massive hands and like, that kind of weird looking face kind of thing. So he obviously evolved into some form, but he didn't become an elder. So what was he? Explain his evolution, please, because he was a douche. Seems only the uh, guy that stands at the entrance when you get down from the elevator really says anything, really. So, you know, this is a village and all, but you'd expect to see, like, maybe two members at least, or three members, you know? Just one, where the hell are all the other ones? I mean, we know there are other members as well. Artisan! So they're working on the statue again. Artisan hopes they don't ask me to help. Oh, I wonder. I wonder. I wonder indeed. Well, you can tell by the fact that I went to his house that he's obviously going to have to be end up working on the statue. Just as Sculptor expected, the Elder's attendant is amazing. Sculptor has learned a lot from attendant already. Attendant thinks we need one more skilled craftsman. Yes, that would be Odyssey. But <laughs> you know from what he said, this isn't gonna be exactly just like, oh, go work on the statue. He'd be like, no. Now, what if we talk to the other shimmy that's here? Oh, heck, why do we j Can you imagine, like, going up to the ultimate draw point? It's like, you on the right and you on the left. You don't need to guard this, right? Well, technically, the. the it kind of like all three of them need to stand there, otherwise you can just sneak past it, technically. One alone is not going to really do anything. <laughs> but how about you? You you got anything to say about the statue? The sculptor is now getting help from the elder's attendant. Especially let's guess it will be finished soon. They need more assistance. I will not say any more. But why is this one, like, not accessible? I mean, seriously, if you're just gonna put it there, you just, like, have something to it. Maybe that's, like, where all the... Maybe that's, like, uh... I don't know. Maybe it's a nightclub. Can you imagine that? Now, imagine, like, you got, like, all the lights and everything. You got the music blasting, and you just got a bunch of shummy with their massive hands, and you got a bunch of mummers, and they're all rocking the hell out! Help at the shop. Artisan can't. There are tons of things that Artisan has to, be, has to do before Artisan becomes a mumba. So that's your plan, isn't it? To become a mumba instead of an elder. Help at the shop. Artisan can't. Now piss off. So what we gotta do is, uh, 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 I think we go talk to the Elder about it, I think, now. 
But man, picture that. A bunch of shummies mulching out. That'd be a random sight. Excuse me, Elder, but it seems we have a slight problem. So they do need one more. Anderson is qualified, but very stubborn. What shall we do? Oh, thanks for the tip. Quistus, you got any ideas? No. Really, you got any ideas? No. Monster, you got any ideas? Yes, he is a very stubborn old fellow. Maybe if I talk to him a second time. Mumba, help me out here. Convince him. He wants to be like you someday. I know what we're supposed to do, but I'm just checking if it's any different. No, Artisan can't do that. I want to become a Mumba, not a stupid sculptor. So, uh, long story short, we're going to Fishman's Horizon. I'll meet you at the ship. First things first, though, let's not forget to draw some more Ultima. Though. It's quite expensive, well, not really, when you really think about it. We've probably got enough money to buy, like, I don't know how many of these. More Ultima. And when we come back to the village, we'll get some more. But we have to go to Fishman's Horizon now. Oh, I wonder where Balam Garden is. Is it still at Fisherman's Horizon as well? Did they travel back to Balam? I don't know, actually. I might check that out. To the ship! Turn this thing around! Let's see, is it, is it back at Balam now, or what? Balam Garden, is it, it's, it's somewhere out there. Probably is at Fisherman's Horizon, which would make this really a pain in the ass, wouldn't it? Yeah, it's still there! This makes things inconvenient. How am I supposed to get to Fisherman's Horizon now? Excuse me, old chap. Wait, actually, no, I think we can actually... We can still park there right here, actually, I think. Yeah. Guess where we park our ship? Yeah, screw you, Mayor of Bricking, uh, Fishman's Horizon. We parked our ship right next to your house. Try to get us kicked out of this place. Just try it. Yes, you're still saying the same thing. You're still ashamed. After three discs of this. Fisherman's Horizon sure has some good music. Like I said before, this could make a good Blitzball Stadium. Ow, 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 except for that. What we gotta do is we gotta talk to Grease Monkey. Probably like, who the hell's Grease Monkey? Uh, that one guy, uh, I can't remember what it is. Regen? Nice, nice. You, well, don't need to go one of that, right? I guess it's cause, uh, you must have only needed one to get to a hundred again, I guess. Hello. You like me, don't you? That was a random thing to say, isn't it? Wait, that's the guy who like was on about Norg that one time. Has he got any uh, information? This world's over, man. I heard that's was getting fresh big time. It's a matter of time before we take a beating. Who would have predicted monsters falling from the sky? So you're making comment on that, I guess. 
Now while we're here, uh, let's, this is the hotel, right? Uh, let's check if, did we pick up a Timber Maniacs here before? Or, or was there even one here? You vouch to get without permission. Get out! Get out! Get out! Renoa! Was that you? Renoa! Where's this? <laughs> get out, get out, get out. We're sorry! I didn't think that would happen. I was looking around, damn it. You still mad at me? Hey, how can I help you? If you want to room the bar. Uh. Actually, let's buy some items. We're running low on stuff. Felix Downs. 22 of them, why not? Yes. Come again. Surprised he didn't comment on any of that. Seriously, what the hell? You'd think he'd be like, hey, no going up there without permission. You didn't even pay. What the hell was that sound? Did a cat break something? Is this a real number? No way, Jose. They, they, you, got, you guys went to the Shimmy Village, huh? Did you meet the guy who made that mumma doll? That doll reacts to the presence of people who went to Shimmy Village. Yeah. High tech, ain't it? I'm a pretty good craftsman myself, but that thing's way out of my league. We spoke to the person who made that mumba and we have a problem. Hey, what's up? Hmm, he's got a lot on his mind, but it seems like what you're trying to do is pretty important. Yeah, I'll help. Let's see. Oh yeah, why don't you take that mumba with you? This baby will solve your problem, guaranteed. Okie dokie. Yeah, what's going on, eh? Yes, like the whole thing with Estra as well, that's that's more important, but we're putting that on hold until we like do side quests. Seriously, what is that sound effect? What? Did they fix they fix things up a bit here? Or tried to anyway. This place was like what the hell are you trying to rebuild here anyway? What what Great weather, huh? Wanna play cards? Sorry, kid, I don't play children's card games anymore. Not since... Space. No, I will inevitably... There's like a freaking side quest for this stuff. We'll, we'll eventually have to get back to that. But not right now. Cute kitty, huh? Old man! What if I kick you in the ass and you fall down the railing? Phew, I've come this far, can't give up now. Well, it wasn't old man, but whatever. Is there anything around here? No. What is that noise? Well, whatever. I want to check out Balam Garden before we go, actually. It's been parked here for a long ass time and we haven't been there since we went to Esfar. Because we took the bridge. They're just like, they're probably like, where the hell are those guys? They're probably be like, where the hell were you? Uh, you're not gonna believe this guys, but we were in space. You're just like, what? Yeah, you remember that Luna Cry thing? What Luna Cry? What's a Luna Cry? Oh crap, you guys don't, okay. But he's still not speaking to us. He doesn't like me, I guess. Gunblade! Trigger! 
Yo, long time no see. Going up? Okay. Get on. Man, it's gonna be a pain in the ass traveling around here. Here we go. Just to visit to Balm Garden, then we'll be on our way. We're obviously not gonna be traveling using Balm Garden, because Balm Garden is slow as hell. That and it's it pretty much just floats over and stuff like that. It can't really fly. So this place is only slightly changed then by the looks of it. People in all the towns probably have something new to say. We haven't even gone to uh, Dalit yet. You remember Dalit? With our first seed mission? Well, the exam anyway. Remember that? We haven't actually revisited that place. Same with Timber actually. We'll be visiting those places again eventually. It's been a long ass time since we came here. If everyone just talks normal, I'm gonna be like, what the hell, man? We haven't seen each other in so long. Third floor. really wanted to challenge Headmaster Sid. Of course, random NPCs like you would never, you know, properly like, whatever, don't care. Don't even acknowledge anything. Okay, if you say nothing, I'm just gonna be like, what the hell? Let's go, squad. Or no, you're just gonna silently just stand there, I see. What's up, Big Zoo? We haven't seen you in a long time. Good morning. My, we haven't seen each other in a while. At least you acknowledged it. Hey, Squall, will you let me ride in that Dragonlight spaceship sometime? Sure, why not, but you can't do that in-game. Imagine that, if you could just invite random characters to the ship. That'd be weird. Are we ready to go? Neither you, asshole. Don't even just like say, hey, long time no see, how have you been? Uh, we've been in space. But you're not even gonna like acknowledge that we've been away for so long, idiot. Well, I'll, I'll meet you back at uh, the ship. Because screw using Balamp for transportation. We've got a better way of transportation now, so it, yes. I'll meet you there. You know, I just realized something. How the hell did Igzu know that this ship was ours? Well, technically, Balm Garden is here, and it's overlooking it, so... I guess they could see it, but... Would they have seen us, like, walking out of it? I mean, they're at, like, the spot where they could literally just easily see the damn thing right from there. I mean, they... And all that, but... I guess they must have saw us come out, or just like... You know, it's obviously them. I mean, they just suddenly randomly turn up for the first time in ages. And suddenly this ship just randomly lands here. How can we just land this here? Isn't this even legal? How can we park here? I wonder what, uh... Crap, I forgot his name. Uh... Mon Martin or whatever. Thinks of our awesome ship. Yeah, you lost Galbadia Garden and we still got Palm Garden and we also got this awesome ship! Well, no need to rub it, rub it in. He was just a guy who was... He wasn't even really doing anything bad, necessarily, was he? Was he... Wait, what What did he do again? Because I think... Was he the one that, like, ordered the assassination on the sorceress, wasn't it? And that's why he, like, ended up getting kicked out. So, technically, while, like... Edia may be alright and all that. She was under control by Ultimitsu at the time, so technically what he was doing wasn't exactly like, you know, incredibly bad. He just like stopped the sorceress thing and all that. And, uh, 
Yeah. Because that's what Seed was meant to be doing. He was just doing his damn job. So, uh, was it going the wrong way there? Back to the Shumi village. Yeah, actually, you have to realize we got to take the elevator down as well. So, I'll actually just beat you when we get there. Even though we're there right now, I just can't be asked going through the elevator seats. Okay, we're back. Let's go talk to Artisan. Artisan, I have this doll... thing. Mumba. Did you make that? Yes, it's the gift Artisan sent to a friend. Why do you have it? Oh, he built a message inside it. Hey, what's happening, bro? Can't contact you directly, so gotta go with this. Oh, it's so good to hear Monkey's voice. <laughs> it's like, it's re is that really a, why everyone calls him Grease Monkey? Even even all of a sudden? I hear you guys are making something. Why don't you quit uh, uh, d uh, dallying and just do it, you know? Yeah, bro, I understand what you're about. I guess I'll leave it to him. Is it blah blah, right? Are you with me? No, because it's going by too fast. Yeah, bro, I understand how you feel, but you're not a son, you're supposed to, and right? Are you with me? Yeah, bro, I understand how you feel and all that, but I'm just like, you know, you're with me and all that, and just like, I'm just saying the same thing over and over again. He's just like, I don't understand how you feel, bro, but you're not a son, you're supposed to, man. Are you, are you all right? You're with me here and all that. Just like, hey, what? He's just kind of just like, I guess we leave now, and then come back in. You with me, right, bro? You with me now, bro? You, you're on, son, right? You right? with me, bro? <laughs> this movement is just like, yeah! 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 Work it! Work it out! Excuse me, you done? Hey, he seems to have stopped. You done? Artisan? Okay, dokie. Um, I kind of confused now. Artisan! Artisan! The Mumba doll is... and uh, Otterson, pay attention, damn it! I think you get the idea. He's encouraging you, just like, go, go out wherever the statue, bro. But you're not doing it. You're just standing around, just raising your arms over and over again. Do I have to go somewhere? What the fuck? What are you doing here? Isn't that the master fisherman? So was you, boy. The elder was just talking about some kids who came here. So why are you here? I'm an honorary shummy, didn't I tell you before? Yeah, did you see that 3D image in the elevator? I helped them make that and some other technical gizmos. Oh, I see. Got tired of the ocean, so I decided to come out to the pond. Can't stay away from fishing, huh? I guess not, it's in my blood. And your name as well, because you're just known as Master Fisherman. What brings you here, boy? Oh yeah, is it gonna be all right? <coughs> What's it doing on your head, man? Artisan is going to do it. Artisan is going to help. Artisan has been misconceived. Nobody has attempted this before, but Artisan has decided to become a human. He invited me to come to FH. Artisan is going to go. Be happy to have you. Good luck. How the hell would that work exactly? So, 
They can all become, become an elder, a douchebag in Nog's case, or a human, which has never been done before, but it seems like it's probably possible, or a mumba. Thank you. Anything else to say, Master Fisherman? I guess I'll stop by when the statue's almost complete. So when does the statue get completed? Do we just leave as well and just like, then we come back straight away and it's fit? And it's maybe, I can't remember. Cause I don't want like a separate video where I come back here randomly and just like, like just to check out the statue. Completed, oh busy busy busy, walking into walls. Hey, they even got the mumba there. Just like, he's probably like shouting words of encouragement. Just like, you can do it, bro, you know, all right, bro, 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 you gotta do it, man. Listen to the voice of the grease monkey. It's been an honor to work with two of the best in the village. And the mumba is a plus. It's encouraging us. It's like, come on, bro, you can do it. You can do it, bros. Come on. It'll be easy to finish since they've done such a fine job already. Quiz is that they're all dead that one time, wasn't it? Doo -doo, doo -doo -doo -doo. It's going well. Still the same old slimes. Let's go. I wonder if the guy at the front of the village has anything new to say. Probably not. Or well, how about the elder, actually? Wait, yeah, the Elder, this, we're supposed to get an item for this, he's probably the one who gives it then. Probably, I don't know. Here we go then, let's see if the Elder is gonna give us, uh, whatever. Oh, Mr. Elder. You were convinced, Artisan. Excellent. Only your wits could have accomplished it. I was going to offer Aris and this to help us. I guess I don't need it anymore. Please take it. Status guard! This may not finish today, but I believe it will be very soon. How soon? Like, if I leave this place right now and come back, will it be done? I'll just check. I don't even know what the status, gu status guard is. Uh, rearrange. No. Swat them. When used in battle, and that's it, we're gonna use that at the end of this part actually. Chocobo related? Not that though, we, we have to go through like, at least visit the Chocobo Garden before I can use this in battle for a certain special something. Well, how do we, like, I think these are like GF abilities to get these, so we can like get spells out of them. That makes kind of invincible, that's nice. I think the Laguna card can be like refined with card mod for 99 or even 100 of those, I think, which is holy shit, incredibly awesome, but I'm not actually going to do that. Stunish card. Oh, nice. Nice, very nice. Quite nice indeed. I shall meet you at the entrance because I am obviously going to pick up an Ultima draw point. Because it's freaking Ultima, man! I'll meet you there. Actually, has this guy got anything new to say? Lots happening in the outside world, but the same goes for here too. What if I talk to you from this side? What's happening outside? Well, we're seeing things here in two and blah. Ah, yeah, we might as well on screen take the elevator up, even though it takes a few seconds. Please have a seat. I mean, you know, in appreciation that the master fisherman, like, did quite a bit of work on this here elevator. Makes sense, actually, now that you think about it. When you look at Fishman's Horizon with their lifts and stuff like that, he's just like, yeah, I can see it. 
Did a master fisherman make that as well? Please take the friend door. And please be sure to buy a souvenir in the form of Ultima. It will cost you another 5,000 gil, but please do buy it. There are our Ultima draw points, but I think they're a one-time only thing. While this one just respawns and respawns, but you have to pay money for it. There's like two islands in this game that have ridiculously overpowered monsters. Like really high level stuff. But they have a shit ton of random hidden draw points. And a lot of them are really good. Ultima freaking uh, full life. Uh, can't really think of them off the top of my head. But there's a lot of good stuff. What is it doing again? Uh, oh yeah. So yeah, you idiot. You're supposed to like go back there. Well, enter. I wonder if they've done on the statue already. I'll go check it out. Be right back.